Hey, what's up guys? So, van life, sporting equipment. So power kiting packs up really small and can be really fun, good activity. Disc golf, all you need is a couple of discs and courses are everywhere and they're free, awesome. Now, if you wanna get on the water, kayaking is an alternative, but it is kind of big and bulky. But if you wanted to get around on land paddling, skateboard, great workout, packs up small. And uh, I really enjoy this one myself. And then also a folding bicycle is really awesome because it's good exercise and a second means of transportation. Another awesome way to get out on the water is for surfing, shortboard, longboard, and they work pretty good for van life. For an SUP, if you want to get out, the inflatable ones pack down nice, good for travel, and the hard ones are a little bit better for surfing, and I'm going that way so I can paddle, surf, and do it all with one board. So I'll show you a few things that I carry with me right now. One is going to be a paddle board, and I use that for both surfing and paddle boarding. It's kind of a cross platform. I use a hard board, and I sacrifice the space for it. So I carry some paddles in here. Have the folding bike stowed away. There's the land board, and also I carry a stand-up paddle. It just depends on what you really want to do and what you want to have the space for. You know, it's you don't want to use up a whole lot of space for things you're not using. Also, carry a hammock with me. So here's the situation: trail, all train board. I'm not gonna lie, that looks like a really fun. Yeah, it looks like really cool. Oh, yeah. Right on. So this type of lifestyle really leads to being outdoors a lot. So there are so many different activities you can do. I'm just bringing a couple of ideas maybe to get out there and enjoy nature. It's good for the soul, it's good for the body, good exercise, and we're out there anyhow, so just do it. Um, a few things to keep in mind though is to know your limitations. Don't try to put yourself in harm's way or danger or anything like that. Know your limitations for sure and have a contingency plan, a little backup, first aid, that type of stuff. And just enjoy, it's, it's one life that we have. So get out there and do it, have fun. Anyhow, hope you guys enjoy the video. If you've got any comments or you wanna see anything else, uh, let me know and we'll catch you on the flip side. Thanks for watching guys, we'll talk to you later. Bloop.